everybody, Coach RJ from www.fitclub.fit, home of the belly burn. Today, I wanna to give you super simple, clean eating guide. I want you to eat until you're 80% full, eat protein with every meal or snack, try intermittent fasting 16 hours a day, have a full cup of water before you eat each meal and snack, and then include two scoops of protein throughout your day, just mix it with water. All right, the first thing I want you to do is eat until you're 80% full. I never want you to stuff. Whenever you get to the point of being stuffed, that means that you've overfilled your body of what you need, and then it's gonna almost instantly get converted into fat. So if you have a plate of food, stop when you slightly feel hungry. If you're still hungry after five minutes of sitting there, then you can finish off your plate. But at 80%, I want you to stop. The second thing is I want you to eat protein with every single meal or every single snack. We know that a bag of chips, we can easily devour that bag of chips, but I want you to eat the bag of chips, but now I want you to pair it with a protein drink, a protein bar, or even some type of meat or protein source that's gonna help slow down the digestion of the chips. The third thing is I want you to try intermittent fasting. So what does that mean? Is that you stop eating for a period of time. The best time to do it is while you're sleeping. So what I would recommend is to stop eating at 7 p.m. And then after 7 p.m., you can still have any zero calorie drinks because it helps to curb the appetite. You can have water, you can have black tea, you can have coffee, but you have to listen to your body. So if you're new to intermittent fasting, you can't think, you get the shakes, or you feel like you're gonna pass out, I want you to eat, but build your way up to 16 hours of fasting. So what is that? That's 7 p.m to 11 a.m. is where you don't eat any calories, okay? You can have anything that's zero calories between that time frame, but until 11 a.m. the next day, I don't want you to have anything to eat. The fourth is super simple. Anytime that you put anything in your mouth that has calories in it, I want you to down a cup of water. So even if you're going to the cubbies and you're gonna grab a handful of nuts, you gotta pound back a glass of water before you eat that handful of nuts, okay? so. If you're gonna go and eat a bunch of snacks or you're gonna have a meal or anything that requires eating calories, I want you to make sure that you drink at least one cup of water before you put any calories into your mouth. And the last thing is a great way to boost up your protein throughout the day. We have tons of great protein options at the gym. You can also buy them online. It doesn't really matter to me. The key is taste. Don't worry about which product is the best. I just want you to find a protein powder that tastes good to you so that you can be consistently having two protein shakes throughout the day. And you don't have to make it complex with adding fruits and berries and nuts and all this and that. Just literally one scoop of powder, half a cup of water, shake it up, drink it and have two throughout the day. Now the best time to have the protein shake is either your first meal of the day. So when you break your fast after a workout or your last thing that you eat before you go to bed. So there's my five super simple ways to clean eating that's gonna help you to shred the fat that we don't want, lose the weight that you don't want, help you to get fit and make this whole nutrition thing super simple. I'm Coach RJ of www.fitclub.fit and we are the home of the belly burn.